Okay, so next up is the Curse of Sherwood. Uh, this is actually another game I never owned, um, and it was a game I played exclusively on the uh, Spectrum Free uh, Plus of a uh, family friend. Um, again, I played it a lot. I always begged, can I play the game? Can I play the Robin Hood, get Robin Hood game? Robin Hood game, even though it's called the Curse of Sherwood. Um, <laughs> so... Um, you don't have any title screen for this one. It literally just loads into that screen there. So yeah, um, this is, you play as Friar Tuck, and I'm not totally sure what the end goal is, although there's, I'm sure there's some kind of curse of Sherwood. Um, and so yeah, it's basically like a, um, I guess it's like a sort of isometric side-on um, um, sort of, uh, well, you know, puzzle adventure game. Essentially, um, we, we didn't work much of it out when we were growing up. Um, it was mostly a case of uh, explore and see how far you could get and see what new screens you could find, as similar to what I was talking about in my Nomad uh, video. So, yeah, you, you have to, you know, complete a few different challenges, um, such as, you know, kill these guys. Um, and uh, you can pick up different items along the way. So right now I've got a sword. Uh, of all you can, you do need different uh, weapons to defeat different um, um, enemies. So you can see I'm doing an absolutely awful job of uh, um, <laughs> killing these guards. Uh, yeah, and so um, essentially, yeah, it, 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 this is exactly how it plays. You just sort of uh, move around. I've got this shield there. Um, you know, you move around and you fight different uh, different enemies. I wouldn't say it's particularly hard. It's uh, it's just one of those games that unless you know what you're doing. Yeah, it's difficult. So there I've picked up the club as a weapon. And the club is um, required to, I think, defeat a particular enemy. It might be an ogre. I'm not totally sure. I am got stuck there. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, yeah. So I'll just uh, fast forward a little bit. Uh, yeah, so you can see a few more of the clips. I think the club is required to defeat uh, this person. I'm not totally sure what it's supposed to be. Uh, just looks like you know you pick up another item, and so the idea is is that you essentially need different items to go uh, to get to different parts of the map and um, you know defeat certain enemies um, in order to collect other parts, other items, and um, yep, there is a very simple like sort of one or two page solutions. One of these uh, things that you maybe find on um, when your friends had it, or you know it was in a magazine where it's like a, you know go left pick up this go back right again pick up that um yeah so i absolutely loved this game um when i was when i was young uh, um, uh, picking up picking it up again um this playthrough is actually after i played it a little while um following a um yeah following a uh, a playthrough guide um so here i don't finish the game but i get uh, much further than i ever got before yeah, brilliant game. Um, the Curse of Sherwood. It's worth checking out.